What's up, you two? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode 55 of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue and Red Rescue Team. In the last episode, we were supposed to make it to the very to the end of the story of the game. Turns out we wound up going to Mount Freeze a day early, added just a little bit of time onto the episode. In today's episode, we are definitely going to be finishing up the storyline. If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit the thumbs up down below. Make sure you subscribe and hit the little bell icon so you can see. Hit the... I'm not saying it. Uh, hit the little bell icon. Chime Don't say it. <laughs> so you can see all the videos that we upload. Check out Neighbor Stuff. Link is in the description. Sit back and enjoy as we finish up the story line. There's no way that nobody else has said hit, hit the chingling, right? Chime that chingling. Chime, chime that ching... God. Am I a genius? Late riser. It's the murky cave next. I need your help for that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> then we'll go to the murky cave. Gardevoir's physical form. That's where it is. What the heck does that mean? That's, you know, we're For my good. sake, Gardevoir. No, that's not important. I just feel like going. <laughs> okay, go there for me. To the murky cave. Oh, yeah, I mean, we've only seen Gardevoir in, like, dream states and such. Right, right. So that's what it means. The only place I want to go is the Murky Cave. I'm not about to tag along, blah, 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 blah. I don't want you to tag along other places. I literally don't want you anywhere else. All right. Do, should we? I'm going to bring someone else. You'll never guess who. I'm bringing Donna Fogel and Aurora. Oh, mm. I don't know how that accent works with that word. Donna Fogel und Aurora. Au, au, <laughs> Aurora. 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 Alright, I have assumed my actual form, which is weird because this actually is not me. Right. But it's pretty much been me for yeah. many episodes. Relatable. Now, I don't remember how long Murky Cave is, but it's, you know. It's, uh, it's a dungeon. It has a first and last floor. Ooh, a joy seed. I've got to, I've got to get these joy seeds so I'm, so I have a chance. You have the ability, the capability, the power. Also, all this money I've just saved over the entire I'm game. I'm glad you said money. I have all of it in mind. Yeah, not a good idea. Not a good idea. Okay. So Murky Cave is where we're heading, and just because I'm curious as to where we need to look. Oh! <laughs> Alright. Are you ready? I'm there. For the final oh. dungeon. Oh. Of Mystery Dungeon. Blue! And red! See what just happened to me? I did. I feel like it's the same thing that happened to you when, uh. You, you know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Shut. Uh, I won't say it. <laughs> <clears throat> You're going to the murky cave. Don't forget to take me. <laughs> I look like I'm walking into a cave made out of, made out of, Merc. Made out of, made out of Merc. Without the K. Mew. Just kidding, hey. without the R. I don't know how to spell. Calm down. This is a quality jam. Wait. Domino. Why are the Pokemon here so weak? Have we been here before? We definitely haven't. We definitely haven't. Oh no, I'm stupid! This is an escort mission. Yes. Escort our, our lovely friend Gengar here. I wonder... I bet, yeah. So even though this is a, even though this is a newer dungeon, it won't let us change team leaders. Uh, likely so that there wasn't any complications with having to program that you specifically can't make 
Vanguard the team leader. Even though they could have been like, hey, he's a Jask, so you can't. I don't know. Yeah, there's... I don't know. It's like... Who was their first Pokemon Mystery Dungeon? Like I said, there have been other Mystery Dungeon games before. And in those games, the mechanics make sense for what they are. You're talking about, like, other franchises? Like Etrian Odyssey Mystery Dungeon? I've never heard of what you just said. I feel like we talked about this, right? Uh, it's Etrian Odyssey Mystery Dungeon. It's a game on the 3DS. Another Mystery Dungeon game. Based on the Etrian Odyssey RPG series. Uh, in which... It's very similar to these games. You should check it out if you have any interest in a similar dungeon crawler style. It's like the same games. Okay, I'll definitely check that out in 2022 or so. Y'all at home who are not quite so tired <laughs> of, of all this, seriously, the I think the game is like on the eShop, like 12 bucks maybe. I know I got it like on extra discount or something. I think I got it for like three or something. Been a while. Dang, you're zooming. Zoom, 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 and zoom, zoom. There we go. This might wind up being a shorter episode. That's okay. Did we find out how many floors there are? I did. Stop at 19. <laughs> ah! Mute. Yeah, this is. See, Septile, TJ. Is level 53 so he hits hard he kills everything in one little one punch mm -hmm. one punch have you seen one punch man i have not that's a thing that you should consider pretty good i've been told pretty short too so i've also been told yeah you know what i'm watching right now i'm watching whose lines in anyway Shop it! I love Shop it. I love Bayonet. You know what's really fun? Is a ghost type that actually has physical attributes in the third generation and below. You know what's not fun? Hmm. Having your food go bad. Not that I'll need it in this dungeon, but that's just annoying. Like, I don't know why they decided, hey, we're gonna make Ghost a physical type and uh, make exclusively special attacking Ghost Pokemon until Gen 3. I I really wish that my Abra was not a big dumb. I wish I didn't have to go out of my way to do this. I had to switch. I had to switch Charizard's. Uh... Heat wave on, and he missed twice. No, 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 Gengar. Run away, Gengar. Oh my goodness, Gengar. No. Wait, how? Okay, I was about to say. I thought you were just about to jump back. I was like, wait, I don't think. I mean, you didn't say you were saving. <laughs> I saved way back when, but. I can't attack while they're in the wall. There's nothing I can do here because the AI is flawed. There's literally nothing I can do. Hmm. Cause Gengar's also in the wall. Gengar's also in the wall and refuses to leave and I can't change his tactics. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Trumpet did something. Doesn't matter, Gengar's cursed. Okay, no longer cursed. I'm so mad. I'm glad that I recruited Shuppet. I'm so mad. I don't like the way the wall mechanics work. It Charizard! Charizard! I hope, man, I hope that they changed that in future games, because I don't remember. Woo! 
<laughs> You're having a rough time all of a sudden. Wait. Out of nowhere. What happened here? We were just we were just chilling. Having a having a stroll. I don't have any memories of fighting stuff trapped in walls from games outside of specific vivid memories as a child playing through Sky Pillar. Or wherever it was. The sky. Where we fight Rayquaza. Not Sky Pillar. What's that area called? Oh, I'm sorry, say that one more time. Where do we fight Rayquaza in this game? Sky Pillar? Alright. Huh? In this game it's called that? You have to hit it with a ghost rock. I know, I dark. can't, but I, I, I can't put Charizard in charge. Exactly. That's what I hate. A simple programming fix. Well, there goes another one of my, uh, survivor seeds. Like, it very easily could have been fixed in the programming, such that we could pick who's the leader here. And I feel like that's so much more important when there's ghosts on the field. Yes. Think of the kids! Think of the kids! Who don't get to save, and I'm just gonna go back and do that again. Think of the kids! Who, even though they have school in the morning, I'm almost at the end of the game, I'm just gonna finish it up and then I'll go to bed. Oh no. And then they get here, and what happens? And what happens? They fight a ghost. They fight a ghost, and their ghost decides to fight a ghost. Like, oh, I'm gonna recruit Shepard. Shepard, I saw, I, I saw you sneaking up to me. You better die. He was already dead before I said any of that. Man. Goodness gracious. Come on! Hashtag artificial difficulty. My favorite. It's not hard because of the challenge it presents to the player. It's hard because you've removed my option. You know... I'll be honest with you, Shepet. I wasn't. Ah! Ha, ha, ha! Almost made a big mistake. Shepet, I was. Ah, save, 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 save. I wasn't going to. Gengar, where are you going? And why are you going there? Gengar. Gengar, you freaking idiot. You just like. It can't see you when, once you're outside of the. Damn ring. Poison spikes. Shep. Mew, you're a freaking idiot. Good thing the stairs are right here. Make sure you don't go too far. I'm almost there. Oh. Mew synchronized took effect. Think of the children! Mom, I just need five more minutes! I can't save in the middle of a battle, Mom. Right! And she's just like, no! You're done! Snatches it! To be fair, that is what the quick save or give up feature is for. Mom, I'm on floor 89! There's 99 floors! I've been in here for three hours! Mom said, you spent three hours on this video game? Said, why are you spending that time on games? How much time did you spend doing your homework? Those games paying for college? Oof. Oh, hey, I went too far. Mom, Fortnite is giving out a hundred million dollars. Why aren't you playing Fortnite? <laughs> Get off that Pokemon! Is studying gonna pay for your college? <laughs> I better see a keyboard and mouse in your hand! Wait, I'm only on floor 9. I thought that. I thought I was just on 18. Wait a minute. Did the game just. Never mind. No complaints. <laughs> I love when I choose the right way to go. Yeah. Alright, did I choose the right way here? Nope. Something is telling me that it was to the right. It was to the right, just, you know. Up. 
Shut up. Chose the right one. I'm literally just firing bullet seeds at everyone. I'm not playing. I'm not playing this dang game. Seriously, Ew, this look looks at how like murky this is. Mucky. We're here at last. This is it? This is the deepest floor of the murky cavern? <laughs> Stairs just appear there. It's a 300 floor dungeon. No. <laughs> I would leave. I would actually. That's the end of Pokemon Mission. <laughs> out the door. Oh, look. There's a dace. What is the dace? Da hey da Siri, what da is D A I S? Star Trek. Discovery is an American television series. Hey Siri, stop Discovery talking. I I have to There's a, there's a hollow spot. I guess that's a I guess that stone goes in there. And that unlocks the door to the 300 floor dungeon. D A I S. What, what does that mean? What does that mean? I want you to know that my last day off was last Saturday, and somebody just asked me, Hey, can you cover my Saturday morning open? I'm not trying to work seven, eight days in a row. So, what is days? A low platform for a lectern, seats of honor, or a throne. See also soapbox, podium. That's not a podium. Nope. Gengar placed a nine tail crest. Oh, excuse me. Gengar placed a nine tail crest in the hollow spot. Ooh. Tanya, if stairs appear here, I'm done. Okay, even if it's just one four, I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> What's this about? Nothing's happening. Did you not collect all the HMs? Can you imagine? Oh no. You need to use HM Cut specifically. Have you recruited Mewtwo? Huh? I thought I heard something. Did you say something? No, even though I'm a even though I have a voice. Yeah. Because I'm the assistant character. I don't have a voice. <laughs> you had on true. No, I'm trying to fix it. That's odd. I could have sworn I heard something. Oh, this is me. <clears throat> what? What was that? I couldn't. What? Oh. Oh. What? I... Speak louder. Welcome to Murky K. Well, that came out of nowhere. <laughs> what? What? Where's that voice coming from? Can you hear me now? Who are you? <clears throat> I don't think this is who is I that... thought I was. No, is that who? I... I don't know, you can have this one then. Because at some point I'm going to have I two am the judge of darkness. <laughs> he got... You have nothing to fear from me. <laughs> he went from, welcome to my I game. mean you no harm. <laughs> Just now, a key was inserted to break a curse. A curse. It is the one on Gardevoir. Exactly! Please lift the curse now! I cannot allow that! Right away! I must first know if you have earned the right. I must evaluate you! You must bear your true feelings to me! You're going to test me? Good thing I have a bullet seed user with me. <laughs> what? I have to fight some boss creature? Let's go. Oh no. Nothing so barbaric. All that I need is for some questions to be answered. However. What, what the? I, I can't move. I feel like the same voice that gave us our little personality test at the beginnings. Hangar! You will not be doing the answering! You! DJ! You will answer! 
motherfucker just steps up. Like, okay. Wait, what are you saying? Why is someone else speaking for me? Let me do it. Anger! Mew does not possess your silver tongue. Your heart is interwoven with conflicting emotions. You will probably never show the truth within your heart. What? You will enter Gengar's heart. Please navigate carefully through Gengar's emotions. So Gengar is the next dungeon. Dang. 54 Gengar dungeon. Dang. If you fail to draw out Gengar's true feelings, the curse will never be broken. Tiki, hey, TJ, Mew, don't you dare fool around. I'll make you pay for it. You have but one chance. Mew, do your best. He literally, like... Fine. It is time. His hit, his life is in our hands. I don't and like he it. says, I'll make you pay for it. We're walking around with a level 15 Pokemon that is trying to threaten us. Right. All I'm saying is I recruited a Pokemon in that dungeon that is significantly stronger. Right. First of all, why does Gengar wish to break this curse? To help Gardevoir or just a whim? I know that Gardevoir said before entering the dungeon, Gardevoir, for my sake, not for your sake. He did have like a change of heart bit at the end. No, he didn't. The end? When? With what? Remember at the end with the Rayquaza where he was dragging us a certain way and it ended up saving us, but it was really ambiguous on whether that was the good or intentional or not? Right. And maybe he was trying to save face and maintain his image. All right, which one are you going with? I'm going with just a whim. Oh, but that's so mean to Gengar. That's why he's trying to break the curse. You think on a whim, somebody's just like, I feel like not being cursed anymore. He doesn't. He just doesn't want to be a Pokemon. It's not to help Gardevoir. I'm going to go with help Gardevoir, and you can go with just a whim. Oh, you know what? I'm saving. Because he said there's one ch- He said- You have only one chance. You know, if you wouldn't have done that, I could have just ran it back in editing. Just a whim. All right. I'm gonna you go. got called out. You got called out straight away. I don't know if that's a lie. I'm not sure. Do you mean that? Do you truly, truly believe that? Well, now I'm confused. See, this one, you could maybe say no. Yeah, yes? I'm gonna say yes, I mean. Nope. Well, I'm gonna let this play out. If that is how you truly feel, my questions will end now. You have no regrets? Okay, I'm gonna save. <laughs> oh wait, I did save, didn't I? I yeah, think I just no, saved. You saved. I understand now. My questions are finished. That was one question, really. <clears throat> wait. So, what's the right way? I don't know. We'll find out. We'll see if this plays out. All right, go. So we're on yours for now. Thank God, whether you have the right to break the curse or not, I will now render my judgment. It's very difficult to explain this. The curse could not be lifted. All right, hold on. Hold on. Before we go any further. Mm -hmm. Need some water. Hmm. I mean, I kind of just want to follow on this. I don't think I need to... We'll see where this goes. See if it gives us a fancy... I think that's correct. <clears throat> I think this is correct. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. 
Where I, I want something. both of our screens on. Okay, I see, I see. So I'm just going to go with it. I understand now. My, my questions are finished. Okay. What, what, wait! It is most regrettable. But the curse on God of War will last all eternity. Wait, wait a minute. Let me, let me say something. It's true, I abandoned Gardevoir and ran. Okay. I was afraid that the curse would fall on me. I had to get away, no matter what. That's what I thought. It didn't take long for me to forget about the curse and about Gardevoir. Many long years passed, but Gardevoir, she never forgot about me. One night, in Domino's dream, Gardevoir, or Dominator's dream, Gardevoir said this. That she considered me an irreplaceable friend, and that she still believed we would meet again. Gardevoir kept thinking about someone like me. But I... How selfish I was! I, I lived carefree all this time! I realize now how selfish I was! It's not just Gardevoir! Team Domination put up with my selfishness and brought me here! I finally know what I was missing! What I lacked! It was something for the others! A sense of gratitude! Ooh, ooh, ooh. The lock bearing the curse. It is opened. <gasps> Get Carnivore! What was my voice for this? Nine Tails. It worked, Gengar. Mickey Tails. Nine tails! But, I don't know what you're saying. The curse has been broken! I cast my curse, enraged at your twisted heart! When your heart gained what it had been missing, the curse was shattered! The final key to break the curse was your sense of gratitude. Then, Gardevoir... You may be reassured, Gardevoir has returned. She will soon awaken. However, that you were her partner in the past, Gardevoir will have no recollection of that. That doesn't matter. Gardevoir is back. That's enough for me. That was fast. Yeah. Thank you so much. My curse has been lifted. You did this for me, even though I had never met you before. I have no idea how to thank you. From the bottom of my heart, thank you so very much for saving me. Good for you, Gardevoir. <clears throat> hey, Dominator. Thanks, thanks for getting me through this. This is my thanks. Mobile scarf. What's that do? Adios. Oh, wait, please. What is it now? Your name. Please, what is your name? It's Gengar. The name's Gengar. Glad to meet you. My name is Gardevoir. I am also glad to meet you. My name is Human. Nice to meet you. Wait a second. Alright, alright. So, now the actual story's gonna end. Surely In there's some... some more significant closure. what if we walk out and there's a guard of war chilling in the uh hither okay she's there she's there she's there she's there she's there i have done a lot of thinking i would like to join team domination and help on rescues please may i become a member heck yeah uh duh Thank you. I promise to do my best for the team. Nickname. Yes, give a nickname. Uh, One of the few Pokemon that I always have a nickname ready for. At this point, there's one name that I can do. Okay, wait. Wait a minute. Where's the end of the story? What if... 
We also find Gangbar. <coughs> Oot and a boot. Somewhere. Where the Gengar is. Um. Somewhere, some weather. Over um, hither and thither. You know, I'm really glad we had some other stuff planned for this. Because <laughs> that was very, very underwhelming. Abrupt. It was like, okay, cool, you confessed. And, uh, great, everything's, everything's been removed. Uh, can we get a hashtag peachy keen in the, in the comments? All right, here's what we're going to do. That's the end of the story. What do you think? I feel like that was a very unsatisfying ending for me to go through all that extra. Right, 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 right. I'm glad that the end had to do with Gengar and Gardevoir. Because it ties back to the actual, instead of it just being a random, like, here's a legendary Pokemon legendary thing happening that wasn't mentioned before. Oh, I can just go through walls. Okay, I'm going to prepare for what's next. Because what's next is scary. What's next is terrifying mm -hmm, mm -hmm. what's next will require me to take every reviver seed i own because there is one last thing for us to do mm -hmm. and i'm going to go into it with a full inventory i don't th i don't see any reason to not go in with a full inventory completely 100 percent full I think I know exactly who I'm going with. Hmm. What level? Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. One. Ah. That's, that's going to be a little rough. This is my move to level five. I like the way that looks. Play that way. Okay, do I have any more citrus berries? No. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Many joy seeds as I can. Probably taking Bolt Beam, to be honest. Oh shoot, I've got a... That just reminded me, I've got a... Okay. I've got to take some TMs. Mm -hmm. But I don't have space. Five Reviver Seeds, five huge apples. I guess I'll just do three huge apples. Take. Oh man, I don't have a clue what I want to take. Let Thunderbolt go. I know I have Thunderbolt. Flamethrower. Did I already get it? Frustration. Oh, I did already get it. Shockwave. I don't have Psychic. That sucks. Yeah, same. But I do have Bolt Beam. I bolt beam in frustration. Okay. Anyway, I think we're going to wrap up right there for now. So, that was the end of the story. I think we agreed that that was a little underwhelming. Yeah, there could have um, been more. Considering, I guess, what we thought might maybe was going to happen. Um, but, in the next episode, the next couple episodes, the last couple episodes, we are going to be heading to... Should we tell them? Oh, we already know. Yeah, they know. It's a level one dungeon. The level one dungeon, which is called Wish Cave. We're going to be aiming to recruit 
Well, kind of, sort of, I guess. One more Pokemon. The series is quickly coming to an end. The finale will be next week. If you enjoyed this episode and I guess enjoyed the rest of the story, hit the thumbs up down below. Make sure that you check out Neighbor Stuff. Link is in the description. Also, make sure that you subscribe, hit the bell icon, um, chime the chingling. What? <laughs> I don't think that's right. But anyway, um, we'll see you in the next episode. Until then, spread some positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.